Hi there, I'm Nick Fur. Today I want to show you a circuit which I see requested a lot on um, Reddit actually and it is a circuit which gives you a number of sequ sequential outputs so when you input a, a pulse it'll turn on the next output along and it'll keep going turning on the next output in the sequence until you get to the end and then it loops back around. Okay, so that's the circuit we're going to look at today. Okay, so let's dive straight in. Right, so I'm going to start off by putting a block, and this circuit is pretty um, configurable, so you can use any number of different outputs, but uh, I'm going to place a hopper here, and we're just going to create a loop of hoppers, and I'm going to put them in two lines side by side like this, and I'm going to break that one so I can complete the loop there, like this, and I'm going to cover it all with redstone dust. And then we're going to place an observer just here, yep, just there, with a torch on it. And that torch is going to lock all of that redstone dust in place so nothing moves. And what I want to do is um, my output is going to be along this side for now, and it's going to be one wide. So I'm going to put comparators along here. I'm going to put them so they read the, um, the hoppers. This, this double. Okay, and I'm going to put a single item into here, it doesn't really matter what it is, and a single item into here as well. Now, my loop is going around this way, around there. Um, so what I need to do now is I need to get a dispenser, and I put the dispenser so it's its output slot is facing sort of in front of your observer. And I can put a powered snow bucket in there and uh, I can put a temporary block there for now or permanent block, whichever. Place a bust on here. And what will happen is if I now place, so we can just see an output, uh, I'm going to put some lamps on this. Now when I press my button, you can see this cycles round to the next output like so. And if you find it convenient to have one wide tileable, you could always do something where you put um, some of your outputs on this side, say, or you could even build, depending on how many outputs you've got, you could build um, a square, right? So like this, and I can have my outputs on all four different sides, like so. And basically the same build, but uh, spreading your outputs out. The other way to spread your outputs out is just to um, have some coming up like this and some going down like this. And that will give you outputs in all of these places as well. They'll just be uh, more spread out. So it's maybe easier to work with. And that's it. So uh, a sequential output selector. And then you can see that it's this next one over here, which is lit. I hope you find that useful in your builds. And if you do, then um, that's fantastic. And I suggest you check out the channel because there's lots of uh, redstone builds and other farms and contraptions in there as well. So if you uh, like what I do, please like and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Thank you.